Hello everybody, so here, and welcome to Portal, part of my 30 days of gaming. So, if anyone doesn't know what Portal is, which if you do not, uh, you've probably been living under a rock. Portal is a puzzle game that you go and you use a portal gun, which allows for pretty much doorways to go and be made, and you to go and complete these puzzles via these doorways. Now, I do have a little bit of a confession to make. It's a little embarrassing. I have never played Portal before. As unbelievable as it is, it's true. So, this is going to be interesting. So, let's see. Let's go in here. Start new game. And let's wait for it to load. Ooh, I'm liking these tunes. Alright. <gasps> oh, let's stay alive. Thank you, Gladys. <laughs> okay. Right now I'm just I'm enjoying my toilet stay right now. And listening to That was awesome. Alright, so anyway, so let's get through. All right, so here we are. There's a camera up there. Some windows. All right. Is it gonna do this for everything? Hold on one minute, I will be right back. And after a quick changed everything I have now gone and made it so that there's no more of those crazy captions it's only subtitles all right so B is actually so B is E Ooh, this is a little wonky having to go and do this with one hand right. uh, nope are you on are you on enough nope you're not there we go Whoa. Okay, well thank you, Glass, for telling me that. Alright, let's go. Oh. oh, there we go. Right through the elevator. It's actually quite nice. Alright. There we go. Alright, Glass, what do I have to do next for level one? Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. Okay, so what I do is, so if that activates that, then I just, whoop, I did the wrong there. Okay, effectively, get you over. Nope. Change it again. Right here. here. Pick, pick you up. Now we wait a minute. Nope, nope, nope. And we 
pop you down. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. <laughs> Ugh. This button exposure, man, it's too much for me. Okay, there we go. We have now done that, so now let's head on through, pop back in our elevator, and uh, go for a ride. Maybe I'll go and I'll have a seat. Do do do. It'd be nice if I'm still alive, play through here too. Oh, yeah, loading screen, and here we are. All right, what's next? You're doing very well. Please Thank be you. advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the aperture science material emancipation grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. Okay, good to know. Thank you, Gladys. So, I have to keep in mind that my fillings may disappear. Okay. Okay. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Okay. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you. Glass, I think you need to go and get some repairs done. You seem a little, uh. a little derpy. There's a no portal zone. Don't care. Ooh, I like that effect. It actually like warps the space around it. That's actually quite cool. Okay. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. You have to do better than that, Gladys. Alright. Wait, um what am I supposed to do here? I can't only fire blue portals, so um uh, Oh. Okay, I think I see what I have to do. Um, let's try King. Nope. Plus, it faces the wrong direction. Uh, oh wait, what am I thinking? I could just do that. Don't mind me being a little derpy. The aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. All right, good idea. Do I have a daughter? I do not know that actually. If I do, that'd be quite awesome. You know what I want? I want a potato. Like right now. If anyone goes and gets the reference. Oh, loading. And here we are. Welcome to test chamber four. Indeed. You're doing quite well. I see the number four right there. So I, indeed, Glass, you are correct. Oh, there's another camera. Right. That's pretty easy. Oh, you, you threw my cube. Aha! Uh -huh. Thought that could stop me. You were wrong. Oh, that's nice. Once again, excellent work. As part of our required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Okay, thank you. So I actually go and do chamber five by myself. Feel wait. Uh, I was like saw a mini portal just pop up for one single moment, so I was like, ooh. Alright, so here we are. Chamber five. Hell yeah. Ooh, I was a little annoying. Okay. So. There seems to be a cube up there. So. 
bureaucracy. How am I going to get that? I don't think I can grab it from here. Let's see. Does that do anything? Does that do anything? Okay. So, let's see. First things first, let's pop down the portal. Walk on through. Oh, there's another one down there. Excellent. Um, and then we go like this. A little bit lower. Oh, I don't want to fall. There we go. Let's pick you up. Just give you a little bit of a through. There and we ow. Hopefully that does not actually hurt. And I do this. Oop. That falling through. Now over there. And now go like this. Bring you back on through with me. And pop you on there. And ha! As part of a required test protocol, our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Oh. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two. <laughs> oh god, this game's awesome. I am shocked I've not played this till now, because I have to admit, it has been very, very enjoyable. Loading. We're on to level six, guys. All right. Stage six. Squad safety is one of many enrichment center goals. The aperture science high energy pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. Please be careful. Well, thank you very much. Oh, you don't know my name or anything? I kind of feel bad, Gladys. You should know my name by now. I mean, how long have you had me here? Who knows? Anyways, on to number seven. devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate a high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. So I guess you have to make it up to there. So let's just go ahead and up it there. And aha! Good. Now use the aperture science on stationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Uh, Guys, I kind of know how I'm supposed to do that. It's not like I can reach it. Team, I'm only able to make one type of. Oh! Alright, so now we wait. The scaffold bounces back over. Till then, you know what? It's time for some squats. Huh. 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 Oh, I can see myself squatting. Ugh. Yes, working on those glutes. Alright. There we go. Bloop. And hooray, we're now on here. Skip and jump over, and we're back here. All right. So there we go. Now we're on to the next area. Let's see what we'll have here. Okay, there we go. We're on the magical number eight. 
Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Well, thank you, Bless. Where is everything that I got? Wait, what? Okay, so if I put that there, you will fire out. Okay, now I see what I have to do. Oh, that's going to be interesting. Um, so, wait for that hell of the fire. It goes through. Is it lower? Right there? Is that it? Nope. Way too short. Alright. Let's try putting it a little bit further down. Bingo! Got it. Okay. So now what I do is I pop a portal here, walk over here, pop a portal over there. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna pop one right this way. Okay. Yeah, that's a good enough spot. There we go. A little close, but. I was able to do it. Burrow. Yeah, that stuff looks kind of murky. Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. Oh, well, thank you, Glass, for telling me that. It's good to know that you're not actually trying to kill me. Just to make it a little bit more of a difficult test, that's all. I squatted right when we were loading. Squat loads. Now we're on to the magical number nine. We're halfway done. That this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. Okay. I don't understand why, but all right. The admission center apologizes for this clearly broken test chamber. Sorry, Glass, I don't believe you. It's nothing against you yourself. I just don't trust you when it comes to you saying that. Let's see. Oop. Once again, the admission center offers its most sincere apologies on the occasion of this unsolvable test environment. Oh, you. What? Uh, come on, cube. You gotta do this. It's you and me. There we go. Frankly, this chamber was a mistake. If we were you, we would quit now. What are you talking about? I just solved it. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. <laughs> oh, God, I love this game. All right, so we're starting to get close to our wrapping up point. This will probably be our last puzzle, and then we'll call it an episode here. So I need momentum to do this. Okay, good. Me walking be enough momentum or jump? I don't know. I know that I need momentum for this one. This is one small thing. Run? Hey, it worked. There was only a little bit of momentum, but it was never some momentum. I don't like this light cube here. That looks weird. There's no one there. Alright, maybe it's just from lighting. Um, okay, there's the... Hoop. 
There we go. You appear to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. Yep, it doesn't actually affect the momentum at all. Okay. Please. A function of mass and velocity is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. I went and I jumped a little. Alright, so we do step one, which is this. Jump. All three. Land on here. And then jump, shoot, and there we go. I believe I'm now on the other side. Am I? Oh, nope, not yet. Okay, so now we go up there and we jump. And there we go. Alright, so, anyways, we'll end it right here in front of our wonderful elevator so hopefully you guys have enjoyed portal part one stay tuned for portal part two and as always this has been cell and take it easy